It's now my honor and pleasure to announce the winner of this year's S.I. Hayakawa Book Prize, which is named for the author of the most popular book on general semantics, Language and Thought and Action. And each year, the Institute of General Semantics awards the S.I. Hayakawa Book Prize in the amount of $1,000 to an outstanding work of direct, on a topic of direct relevance to general semantics. Now, this year's winner is a popular work grounded in linguistics and, and etymology, not entomology, etymology. <laughs> One that references Alan Walker Reed, a major intellectual figure and contributor to general semantics in the Institute. And in general semantics, we're concerned not only with the meanings of words, but with the ways in which people respond to them our semantic reactions, some of our strongest and most irrational semantic reactions are reserved for the words we deem offensive, that are taboo, are curse words and bigot words. It takes more than a little courage to write a book about those kind of words, but that's exactly what this year's winning publication is all about. It's only by confronting these words that we can gain a measure of control over them and over ourselves. The title of the book selected for this year's Hayakawa Award is Nine Nasty Words, English in the Gutter, Then, Now, and Forever. And it's on sale here tonight um, for below cost, so please pick up a copy. The author is an associate professor of linguistics at Columbia University. He's a frequent contributor to a variety of magazines and newspapers and he, including The Atlantic, Time Magazine, and The New York Times. And he's the author of more than a dozen books. And uh, unfortunately, though, uh, and he is ill and is not able to join us tonight. Um, you know, here's the plaque you can see. Um, so uh, we will applaud him in absentia. And if he wants the check and the plaque, he's going to have to come get it, I guess. Uh, <laughs> So, yes, it was premature, but that's okay. So, join me in congratulating John H. McWhorter.